this house in the Lord. Welcome to our weekly Sunday meditation today, October 6, 2024. Whatever has held you captive, making it impossible for you to fulfill your true freedom, spiritually, economically, physically, or materially, we give way this season in the name of Jesus Christ. As October is the month of our independence as a nation, God also wants you to enjoy his true freedom in every possible way. He has not created you to be in a bondage. His desire for you is to have joy and have it abundantly. Therefore, in the month of October, our topic for meditation is true freedom only comes from God. Today, we shall be looking at the story of Joseph in Genesis chapter 39 and verses 11 and 12. And I read, but it happened about this time when Joseph went into the house to do his work and none of the men of the house was inside that she caught him by his garment, saying, Lie with me. But he, Joseph, left his garment in her hand and fled and ran outside. There are many people today who are living and are in bondage, but they do not know because of the seeming earthly players. Although Joseph was a slave in the house of Potiphar, but he was a man who feared the Lord and chose not to sin against God by committing adultery with his master's wife, as recorded in Genesis chapter 39 and verse 9. Our text shows that while the wife of his master wanted him to sleep with her, Joseph left his garment in her hand and fled and ran outside. The scripture says in 1 John chapter 3 and verse 3a, He who sins is of the devil, for the devil has sinned from the beginning. Regardless of your social status, political connection, your title in the church, the level of your wealth, if sin and ungodly acts dominate your life, you are of the devil. But then, the good news is, as recorded in John chapter 8, verse 36, therefore, if the Son makes you free, you shall be free indeed. My brother and sister, sin is a wicked act. And the scripture says in Isaiah 48, verse 22, there is no peace, says the Lord for the wicked. Do you want to be released? From that captivity of sin, then let Jesus Christ take over the reign of your life and allow him to rule in your life today, and you shall be free indeed. And then you will fulfill your destiny as a child of God. Have a blessed and victorious week ahead in Jesus' name. Amen.